Well, the weather is getting cooler, as Tom said, and the leaves are changing, meaning it's time for all you leaf peepers out there to grab your smartphones and start snapping pictures of the beautiful fall foliage. We have Steve Johnson from Verizon Wireless here this morning to talk all about fall for our apps of the week. Good morning, Steve. Morning. Well, let's get right into it. So this is a social network for leaf peepers. That's a weird phrase, but it's, it's what they're called, right? Yeah, so uh, this is an interesting time of the year. A lot of individuals that are interested in trees love to go out and see as the leaves change, look at the different colors. And what Leaf Peeper does is it gives you a kind of a social networking interactive way to see exactly where the leaves are changing, where to go, and also be able to report not only photos but actual, you know, pictures uh, of, uh, of the leaves of the leaves changing. Very cool. So you said with this monitor you can actually report to other leaf peepers as they're called yep. when the peak season for watching leaves is, correct? Yeah, you can actually use your location, change where the actual leaves are changing, report that so other users can see that. And then on the map here, it actually will give you a layout. You can double click and you can actually see some pictures of, of as the leaves are as the leaves are changing in different uh, particular counties and if you're traveling. So maybe if you're a fan of Instagram and you also love nature, this would be a great app for you because you can take the photos, you can find the peak seasons in here. What a, what a neat app. Is there anything else that you could, what, what does peep it mean? Yeah, so peep it is when you actually report <laughs> it. So when you actually see the leaves change and you peep it, it actually updates the site. And you can also link to uh, social networking so you can share what you're looking at on Facebook, okay. Twitter, things like that. So iOS, Android, and this is a free app, correct? Absolutely. Wonderful. Well, let's get into the next app. Then you said, and I cannot pronounce it to save my life. <laughs> so this is, this is Audubon, Audubon. And the best Audubon. way to explain this is think of it as an encyc encyclopedia for everything surrounding trees or shrubs. And what I like about this is everything loads, loads on the device. Uh, it's just like an encyclopedia, so you don't have to worry about it extending your, um, your, your data usage on, on the Verizon oh, network. Nice. But as an example here, you can go into advanced search. So you can search by region, so Northwest Ohio or, Mid or Great Lakes, and you can actually look up particular trees. So okay. I'll just show the sugar, sugar maple, maple here. Is what you you know use for maple syrup. So you could take the kids out, and you can not only uh, look at these pictures and read more about the trees. Correct. You can also journal it, which is kind of cool if you want to get your kids more into nature and into what's going on with these trees and leaves. Correct. Yeah. So you can journal it, share it, and what I think. Uh, obviously for enthusiasts, but also at this, this time of year, a lot of kids have these high school projects. So I think it's just a great opportunity to take your kids, go out into a local Toledo park, actually be able to look at the different leaves and be able to pull up and see exactly what the tree is, Wonderful. look up information on it, the description, and maybe help your How son cool or daughter that? on their project. Well, I think we have a infographic for everyone at home if you want to check it out. It's uh, Leaf Peeper is the first app. It's free for iOS and Android. It has about a three-star rating. And then Audubon is a paid app. It's $4.99, mm -hmm. iOS and Android. Thanks again, Steve, so much for joining us this morning. Some great apps for all the fall uh, colors that we're seeing.